The African Crossroads community is a community of African creators based on the African continent who interact with each other on issues, themes, designing, graphics, comedy, free expression, music. African Crossroads comprises of a diverse network and not only just because of what you were seeing here today at the physical space based here in Harare, Zimbabwe. We have people that are in Kenya, we have people that are in West Africa, we have people that are in East Africa and we have people that are in MENA, Middle East, North Africa. The role of Vivos through its program titled Civic Rights in a, in a Digital Age generally seeks to promote free expression in Africa. I sat on a panel with three other industry professionals titled Hacking the Creative Marketing Access. Um, I think it was such a great dialogue to have because it speaks to a very big challenge that we have here in Zimbabwe where a lot of individuals and organizations do not have access to the amount of funding or right amount of funding um, to actually support their creative endeavors. A lot of the world on the internet access to the world, especially in the developing world, is in the image of Mark Zuckerberg. Um, with the partnership that he has with mobile operators that have subsidized rates and so forth that keep people on WhatsApp and keep people on Facebook. And to them, that's the internet. Not only because that's where the audience is, but they can't afford to go outside that. Which ultimately is a problem because as an artist, for example, up until three years ago, Facebook was not paying me for the intellectual property. most interesting session was optimizing the role of women. As a feminist, I believe that women need to be given voices for them to speak about their struggles in the creative sector and how they, what the challenges that they face and how they can mitigate these challenges. The issues that were raised were very important. We're talking about safety, not just physical safety. We're talking about learning to read contracts. We're talking about educating ourselves, uh, bettering ourselves. We're talking about opening doors for other women to come through so that generations that will come after us will at least thank us. 